Thursday, June 30th, 2022, leaving Fort Pulaski, heading back, I uh, think we're going to go to um, one of these Georgia State Parks, Fort McAllister. Maybe work on some video, I'm not sure yet. I'm not sure how, um, how high it's going to get today. We'll probably have to crank up our air conditioner tonight. <laughs> our raw OB fan and get us a cooler with two bags of ice. It worked pretty good the other night. If I insulate this thing and put a, I say, a curtain across this front part of the cab, Shoot, it'll keep it it'll keep the back back here real cool. I guess if I lived on Tybee Island, I'd be going fast up and down through here too. Because it is a good little stretch to get off the island. Speed limit is 30, no, speed limit is 55, okay, I'm going to say speed limit is 35, but yeah, speed limit is 55, we're running 45. Spot. Let's turn in here. We'll let these people get by. Yeah, I would not want to live on this island just because of that. If I, if I was a person that didn't leave the island hardly ever. It'd be fine. Yeah, if you live, work, and play on the island, it ought to be all right. But if you're going to leave once or twice a day, I wouldn't want to live here at all at any price.
get to that road over there. to Fort McAllister. have a site open it probably won't be but for one night but that may be all I'd want it for download a bunch of stuff tonight or today and tonight get some stuff uploaded and then uh, stay in the truck stops the rest of the time while we're down here unless we can find a national site that we get half price for. Okay, I'll start another one. Okay, coming out of Fort um, Pulaski on the way to Fort uh, State Park. Georgia State Park, Fort McAllister. 56 minutes, we want video probably 10, 15, just part of Savannah. Hey, look at that bicycle. That's an interesting one. Hill and just see if they had time to tune this hours up. We could uh, leave it, come back, get it tomorrow. I want to find out what that noise is. Highway 80, Georgia Highway 26. We're going to be bearing off to the left in about a little over half of a mile. We'll go ahead and get over in that left lane. Make sure there's nobody over there next to us. Somebody like to run into us coming on uh, a Tybee. They just they were in the park and we were coming by and they just cut out. Almost right, right into our side. Not paying attention, I guess. Red light. Okay, 7.3 miles we turn. We'll turn left and stay on US 80. I guess we'll be going back through Savannah. Yeah, it's not likely uh, any of these state parks or federal stuff is going to have a site for tonight, so we'll probably be staying 
at the truck stops. So we'll get a spare foam cooler from the Walmart or somewhere and put two bags of ice in it, put the fan on it, and stay cool. We'll improvise. There's a public in a Walmart there. may be a public's market though, may not be a super center. My palm was itching the other day and it's itching again today. Somebody needs to send me some money. <laughs> some money as expensive as gas is boy how much money as I put in parts in this van need me some money to the right hand lane if we can I thought we were going to have to turn and would be changing lanes but I don't like being in the left lane holding people up of course I don't guess I'm holding them up there's nowhere for them to go with those two in front of us but I'm going to drop over behind this guy now whoever thought a truck would run $80,000 get a four wheel drive truck with that step bumper Blooming bumpers can be $4,000 with that locket system and that step on it. Stuff is unreal. A locking bumper with a step on it run four or $5,000. Or not bumper, like a locking tailgate, I mean. People steal tailgates, $3,000 tailgate. changed folks there's nothing like it used to be market. I don't know that I've ever I may have seen or heard of them but Bonaventure Cemetery we may do that early one morning depending on how close we stay and, if, and if, if, even if we stay 